Hi everyone and welcome back to today's Morning Report chart appraisals with me, Richard Perry, Market Analyst at Hantech Markets on Wednesday the 1st of October. I'm going to move on to sterling dollar now and again uh, the, this dollar strength is impacting this chart. The last what, four or five days we've had a series of lower highs and lower lows on, um, on this sterling dollar and it just continues to drag towards this 6160 level which is the uh, rebound low, uh, the higher low um, that we had within the recovery. Now you look at these momentum indicators on this on this daily chart, they are all in bearish configuration and quite concerning. You see this RSI that uh, tipped out around that just below that 50 level. MACD lines are now coming together looking like they're going to turn lower. Stochastics are in decline as well so it just suggests that there is further pressure to the downside and the momentum is pretty strong with it with the um, with the bears you've still got this downtrend that is broadly intact I mean you did have that spike to the upside but certainly I think you would say that this downtrend is still intact uh, that downtrend currently comes in at 63.27 so there is still room for a bit of a um, bit of a rebound within the downtrend um, before further selling pressure could be seen but looking at this this is on the intraday hourly chart. I've drawn in this um, a new downtrend that we've got on this uh, on this intraday chart. Now, you've had this this recovery uptrend broken, so we're now into this new downtrend phase, and uh, sequence of lower highs and lower lows. And the big resistance comes in around that 62.80 mark, which was which was um, the old resistance became support, and then is now new resistance once again. So further. Um, that is the big resistance on the uh, on the intraday chart. Minor resistance, you'd say, around 62.30, which, uh, if I get my crosshairs in, is around about where the old lows from the 29th of September came in um, and pr provided a bit of an intraday cap to the gains yesterday or the rebound yesterday. So, so that is the uh, that's the initial resistance. But you look at these hourly momentum indicators negative configuration on the MACD lines all below neutral for the last few days. RSI as well consistently hits around about that 60 mark on the rebounds and sells off into oversold territory. So that would certainly suggest negative configuration in that as well and also all these moving averages falling in bearish sequence. So pretty much across the board a bearish outlook and suggests selling into into any strength you get is, a, is um, uh, the best plan of action. So I wish you good luck in your trading on cable today. Don't forget you've got the manufacturing PMI data for the UK and the US in a bit. Um, well, the UK at 9.30 and US at 3 o'clock this afternoon, but certainly that could have an impact on this chart. But until then, I wish you good luck in your trading, and I will speak to you later. Thank you.